hello viewers so after discussing so many lectures on pharmacology so from now onwards i'll be taking up lectures on physiology and biochemistry and anatomy also so first today's topic of my discussion will be on anatomy particularly today that i'll be discussing about the tricks to remember the suprahyoid and the infrahyoid muscles so viewers this is a very confusing and a most difficult thing to remember as to what are the suprahyoid and the infrahyoid muscles so in order to remember and mostly you know i get con mostly confused as to how to remember these suprahyoid and infrahyoid muscles because these are a bit very confusing so viewers and students the mnemonic or the short trick what i have made over here it's the statement over here as you can see the hello great ms dhoni took the toss if we just remember this quotation this quote of mine that is hello great ms dhoni took the toss so we can very easily make out as to what are the suprahyoid muscles and what are the infrahyoid muscles so just uh, students be very clear that the hyoid bone is somewhat located in the neck and the muscles which are going to be lie lying above it they are the suprahyoid and the those below it are known as the infrahyoid muscles so in order to remember easily we can just look at the initials of the statement that is h of the hello g of the great msd that is ms thoni he is a very famous indian cricketer as you all know for the viewers who are watching in usa i would like to tell you that ms dhoni that is msd up till here we have we have the suprahyoid muscle mnemonic and took the toss particularly the t o s s of the toss will refer to the each of the infrahyoid muscles so all right now moving on to this h viewers h of the hello refers to the hyoglossus muscle all right g of the great refers to the geniohyoid m refers to the mylohyoid s to the stylohyoid and d to the digastric so uh, students when you uh, look at the anatomy just make this very clear the hyoid bone to the tongue that is the hyoglossus muscle obviously it is going to lie above the hyoid bone next moving on to the geniohyoid that is the from the genial tubercle to the hyoid bone to the next suprahyoid muscle that is next from the myeloglos myo mylohyoid muscle so that is forming the floor of the mouth to the hyoid bone that is the uh, mylohyoid muscle from next the s that is the from the styloid process to the hyoid bone and next that is d that is the digastric muscles so hello great msd that is h g m s d h g m s d is referring to the it's, it's making us remember about the suprahyoid muscle now took the toss so the every alphabet of the toss is going to refer to the infrahyoid muscles viewers so infrahyoid muscles the muscles which are going to lie below they are having their origin and insertion they are originating below the hyoid bone and they are getting inserted to the hyoid bone so looking at it we are going to have the t of the toss refers to the thyrohyoid muscle all right so the o refers to the omohyoid muscle the s of the toss refers to the sternothyroid that is the origin of this muscle is from the sternum to the hyoid bone and the next s refers to the sternothyroid that is starting from the sternum to the thyroid gland so all right so toss is referring to the infrahyoid muscles so viewers in this way i have made very easy as to how we can very easily remember the suprahyoid and the infrahyoid muscles particularly in the exam center and that too in the competitive exams when we go for mcqs it becomes very difficult to make out among the four options as to what are the infrahyoid and what are the suprahyoid muscles so in the examination center just by looking at this trick just by looking at the statement or quotation quote what i have made that hello great msd took the toss we can very easily pick the correct answer and get benefited in the exams too so viewers this was my analysis or the short trick as to how we can very easily remember the suprahyoid and the infrahyoid muscles so viewers if you do like my video don't forget to subscribe my channel and do press the bell icon so that you can be further updated about my newer videos thank you for watching